This is a spacecraft and rocket company. What we're trying to do is really build a 21st century aerospace company. Building spacecraft is just incredibly hard. It's really one of the hardest mechanical things you can think of doing. The rocket engines are incredibly powerful. The first rocket we've designed has about a million horsepower. It's like a thousand sports cars running at the same time. It's out of power. Schedule is probably the most important thing to us. We're trying to have a competitive advantage. First to market is a big deal. There's a lot of us in the market. There's only gonna be a few that succeed. The lightest weight, strongest aerospace structures are being built with carbon fiber, and that's what we'll be deploying to create very reproducible structures very rapidly. 10 times faster to make a rocket using this one machine, we can make a rocket in nine days. A lot of things go into designing, building, flying successful rockets. We've used the entire Autodesk suite. We design Alpha and Autodesk Inventor. The ease of Inventor has made it possible for us to go kind of at the pace that we're going at right now. You're not clicking into 17 different menus to find exactly what you need. We use Vault. Only one person can make changes to our CAD files at a time. That allows us to not do duplicate work uh, as we are racing against the clock. After we fly Alpha successfully for the first time, we'll be looking to improve the design and make it even better. And that's when we can really start to look at advanced design tools such as generative design so that we can optimize what has already been done by humans using uh, algorithms that are found in generative design. We always need to be one step ahead in doing things better. Leveraging these new tools is an avenue that allows us to do that. Autodesk gives us an advantage to stay ahead of the competition.